Hey, happy Tuesday. I hope that whenever you're hearing this video, watching this video, listening to the podcast, or just reading the devotional, I hope it's a blessed day for you. See, God is attentive to us. God knows our every thought, our every prayer. God speaks. He's spoken and He speaks. Hebrews 1, 1 and 2, long ago God spoke to our ancestors by the prophets at different times and in different ways. In these last days, He has spoken to us by His Son. God has appointed Him heir of all things and made the universe through Him. Prophets. Prophets deliver messages. The, the, the technical definition of a prophet is one who delivers a message from God to God's people. Through the prophets, there were signs and wonders. So we've got signs, wonders, and words. The key to understanding God's speak is to trust that it is God who is speaking. To understand the means and method in which God speaks. When God speaks, we trust that it is God and that he has a message for us. God wants to share with us. God wants to reveal himself to us. I believe that God can speak any way he wants to. But I also believe that we live in a culture and in a time when, when that is sometimes abused. It's been abused. Some use the perceived voice of God for all the wrong reasons. Any time that we would somehow promote ourselves while proclaiming God's word, that, that's a problem. When God speaks, he never contradicts himself. He never contradicts his spoken, written, or living word. God can communicate with us by his spirit. An old study, it's, it's a 30-year-old study now, but it was called Experiencing God. Matter of fact, there's probably a book behind me somewhere right here titled Experiencing God by Henry Blackaby. And, and, and what he said in that book was God speaks by His Spirit through the circumstances of our lives, through the body of Christ, through His own Word. See, God speaks. God speaks through Jesus. Let's listen for what God has to say to us today. Hebrews 1, 1 and 2, long ago, God spoke to our ancestors by the prophets at different times and in different ways. In these last days, he has spoken to us by his son. God has appointed him heir of all things and made the universe through him. See you next time.